hello guys in this video we are going to talk about that how you can use advanced filter in an excel file this feature is available in all the versions of excel and it can help you in many efficient manner okay so it can help you to paste the filtered criteria based values in the different sheet that can help you in doing the data analysis based on the criteria. okay so before we start talking about that how you can use it i request you to please subscribe my youtube channel and click on below bell icon to get the notifications and please do not forget to share this video with your colleagues with your friends and please do help us to promote so let's start to understand this advanced filter feature okay so what we are going to do on my screen you can see that i have this data listed which is the sales data by country wise and i have the sales volume listed so what i wanted to do with this data i wanted to filter basically the sales line which belong to this australia and united states country okay so what i need to do i need to activate this advanced filter which you can find under the data menu here you can go and here you can see this advanced filter and i have already listed these values okay so but before i talk about these things so let me remove this and uh, let me talk about these two options if you use filter the list in place it means that you want to filter the data within the data itself okay so when you use this feature your data will be filtered out only in this video okay so what you can do you need to take this box copy to another location because we want to paste the filtered value on the different sheet or on a different cell okay so once i click on this copy to another location i can see this list range so list range means the data from where you want to filter the criteria so you select this filter by pressing like uh, by selecting the first cell then pressing shift right arrow key and then press control along with shift and then press down arrow key it will select the entire data and then you can go to criteria range you can go up by scrolling this scroll bar here you need to select the criteria range okay we have this country australia united states so now we have this copy to so copy to i want to copy data in the g5 cell and i can click ok and now you can see that i have filtered all the data which belong to australia and united states here so that is how you can use advanced filter now let's paste the data on the different sheet by using this advanced filter option but before that you need to understand one concept so you need to make sure that you use advanced filter or you activate the advanced filter option on the activated sheet okay so you can see right now the activated sheet is what i'm watching on my screen so i'm watching this advanced filter single criteria sheet on my sheet so it means that this is active sheet okay if i use this advanced filter by selecting the data by giving the criteria and then activating the filter it will not throw out the value on the different sheet okay so because in this case we want to paste the data on a different sheet okay so in order to do this you need to activate that sheet so let me create one sample sheet for you i have this sheet one which i can like uh, name destination sheet okay now i want to paste my filtered value in this destination sheet at a1 cell now i need to click advanced okay because i want to paste the data here and it is active sheet right now on my screen so i can click advanced and i can take this copy to another location so i have this list range i can go back to this advanced filter single criteria and i can select this entire data and i can select the criteria range as well okay criteria range is also mentioned in this sheet so i can go back and i can select the criteria then i have this copy to then when i'm pasting to the copy to it means that i want to paste the data to the destination sheet which is my active sheet that even cell i need to select and i need to click okay and when you click okay you can see the data has been pasted so that is how you can paste the filtered data on the different sheet hope you like this trick 
Now we are going to talk about how you can use multiple criteria in advanced filter. Okay, and you need to understand it very carefully. So let's understand this. I have some criteria listed on this advanced filter multi criteria sheet. And now you can see that I have these criteria. Okay, but before listing down the criteria, you need to make sure you understand this very carefully. So suppose I have the sales volume in the first column. I want to filter the values which is more than 2000. Then I have countries. So I want to filter only Australia, Singapore country. Then I have these sales reps. So I want to filter the data only for these sales reps. So there are three sales reps. So now if you have observed the pattern, how I have written these criteria. So suppose if I paste this sales volume in the last column. And if I use the filter, it will not work correctly. You can try it by your own. If I filter, like if I copy this country at the last column, then again, it will not work. Okay. So what you need to make sure, you need to make sure that you need to keep the criteria column at first, which has the lowest criteria. Okay. The sales in the sales volume, you can see we have only one criteria. Then we have the Australia Singapore, the second criteria. Then we have three criteria under the sales wrap. So you need to mention these criteria in the ascending order. Okay. So I need to put sales volume in at first because I have only one criteria for this. Then I have country. I need to paste it in the G column. That is two. Okay. One criteria, two criteria, then three criteria. Okay. Hope you understood this concept. If you do not use it, if you just jumble these criteria here and there, then your advanced filter will not give you the correct result. So now you can see I have one criteria under the sales volume. I have two criteria under the country column and I have three criteria in the sales wrap column. Now I'm going to use it. Okay. I can select either the active sheet in the similar method, how I used in the destination sheet, the advanced filter. Okay. But I want to paste the data in the same sheet. So I am using this sheet and I'm selecting this range and I'm clicking on advanced. I can just go to this copy to another location. Here I have this A1 to D49 data range. Then I have this criteria G1 to I4. So I just need to change this also. It should be starting from F1 and ending at H4. Then copy to here. I can select any blank cell where I want to paste the data and I can click OK. Now you can see that it worked. Okay. So that is how you should be using advanced filter for multiple criteria. If you want to use wild characters like I have used for the sales volume, like greater than 2000. Okay. So you can use greater than sign, lesser than sign, equal to sign or any other wild character in the similar method. Okay. You can filter the data where you have date. So if you want to like filter the data between a time range or the date range, you can use the similar white collectors and you can filter the data. The only thing you need to remember that you need to list down your criteria in the ascending order. Okay. That you understood. If you have any question, you can just comment below. We will be answering your question. Hope you like this video. Please do share this video with your friends and do not forget to subscribe my channel. Be in touch. We'll be learning more stuffs. Thank you.